In 2001, in the United States, we had pretty much eliminated the transmission of HIV from mother to child with access to drugs, treatment, good care. In Africa, it was very different. I remember being actually in Soweto and talking to a mom who had just been tested and her entire life flashed before her. She thought about the fact that her partner had already died. She was scared. Her mother was no longer alive from TB. Her father was no longer alive. She had no one else to care for her, a child that was still unborn. Mm -hmm. And from the happiest moment that she should have been thinking about this baby, it was pure terror. The organization's arrival on the scene was a, like a bright light breaking through a cloud of darkness. The idea, simply, of an HIV positive woman being able to put her arms around another woman who was finding out the terror of finding out that she's HIV positive, and at that moment being able to say, it's okay, I'm positive too, we're gonna get through this. It's the humanity, it's the fact that she has a bit more time to be able to connect with this individual who is focusing on her baby. She's focusing on potential and life, and that's taken away in that moment. And what Mothers to Mothers does is we steal back that time. And in that support, we take that darkness, we take that despair, we take that fear, and we retransform it into hope and into life.